it's Street Fighter V week and we're going crazy for the return of Capcom's fantastic fighting franchise. It's a game poised to appeal to both long-standing fans and series newcomers and if you're still on the fence, here are five reasons you really ought to check it out. First up is accessibility. Capcom have made much of the importance of appealing to both newcomers and seasoned veterans with Street Fighter V. As such, moves are a little easier to pull off in this game with timings proving more forgiving, but the strategic elements of the game mean that the easy to pick up, difficult to master mantra will still hold true. Much to the joy of hardcore fans. The tweaking of certain elements of the gameplay matches this mantra too. Series producer Yoshinori Ono has talked of this game being something of a reset for the series with V-triggers and critical arts, replacing the focus attacks and ultras of this game's predecessor. But perhaps best of all, the stun meter returns, designed to promote more offensive play and encourage tactical aggression. As such, Street Fighter V is pacier and perhaps a more exciting affair. The diverse range of characters to choose from has always been one of Street Fighter's finest aspects. The finely tuned balancing means that you can win with absolutely any character, you just have to find one that suits your style of play. And whether you treasure speed or throwing ability or powerful heavy hitting, there'll be someone for you on the base roster of 16 characters out of the box with Street Fighter V. You'll never run out of people to fight in Street Fighter V. For the first time, the series is going cross-platform with its multiplayer, allowing PC and PS4 players to square off against one another. While providing a diverse range of opponents for new players to further hone their skills, it also ensures that console players aren't segregated from the PC crowd, and places everyone on a level playing field for when it comes to esports and tournament play. Perhaps most excitingly of all though, Capcom have learned from the past. There will be no super or ultra versions of Street Fighter V, just a base game, a platform almost, that grows and evolves over time. Twin currencies and an expansive release schedule paint a future for Street Fighter V that is content rich and stuffed with opportunity. The only question is, will you heed the call and rise up?